Hello YouTube, I'm Music Kev, and this is Shovel Knight. Last time I beat the mini boss, which would earn me a save spot if I wasn't blowing them all up. Or I should say checkpoint. I do help hope though that I don't have to refight the mini boss. Oh my, oh my. If I die. Okay. Um, yeah, I should not have trusted my, um, my ability to precision platform there. I, now that I'm thinking about it, I really do want to look up to see, well, I mentioned on an earlier episode about how the speedrunners play in New Game Plus, and they're good enough that they it doesn't matter that it's harder. And that just made me think about actually looking up to see the, um... To see speedrunners play this game. Just to see how... How they tackle certain tasks. Leave me alone, rat. Oh, this is my chance to, um... Get to this explodey part. There we go. See, something good came out of it. You guys get to see a new screen. I get to try to not die on this one. Oh my god. Oh my god, please don't die. I get some more gold. It's a win-win-win-win-win. I'm assuming that there's more than one person watching, so that's why I put more than wins. One win in front and behind my win. And then there's Shovel Knight's win, so that's two. And then... Yeah, I'm gonna stop talking now. Boink. But yeah. I, and also, I love this background. Have I mentioned that already? I mentioned that in the last episode when I came here the first time. But I love it. It's completely awesome. And... Very suitable for the, um... Did I never do that? Huh. Leave me alone. Very suited for the, um... Feel of the level. Oops. Oops. Dude. Okay, come on. Can we... Like I said, I bet there's something... Oh yeah, that's right. There is something up there and it drops down to there. And I... Got that already? Okay. Um, and I do have to fight the boss again. That's okay. This guy's a pushover. Assuming that I don't die in this for a stupid reason, like, I don't know, thinking that the guy's a pushover? Okay, there's my life back. Okay, remind me how I died here? Oh yeah, I took damage from that and got pushed back. Well, that's not gonna happen again. He said overconfidently. As much as I would like to collect those, I don't think I have the luxury. I didn't even see that guy coming. He's going right in with a background, dude. See, on the other game, I don't know why I valued money so much on my second playthrough. I think there was stuff that I was able to unlock. I hate this. It basically requires you to either do exactly right jumping. I saw that. 
Oh no. Or use the phase locket. Which is weird that another stage would make you use an item that you got in a... Yeah, see, I just can't quite time that perfectly. Yeah, if I didn't have all the upgrades that I really care about, I would concern myself more with the money that I had. I mean, there's one more upgrade that I could get if I really wanted to, is the the Spark Sword. Oh, hi. Hi, ghost version of me. But, the, honestly, the amount of time that I actually spend at full life... ...is... ...minimal. Okay, I suppose I deserve that. But you know what? He can stay down there. Really? Oh, okay, I see. Yeah, you know what? I'm not dealing with you. I'm not dealing with you either. Can I get a lift? Thank you. Just kick him around a little bit. Now... I would waste what is in my um, inventory to summon that trapple, but I can't trust what he'll give me. Alright. Key, leave me alone. Show yourself, Plague Knight. Your trickery will not stop me. Trickery? <laughs> the fruits of my research are no mere trick. Boom! Hee hee hee! Now let's have a listen, shall we? I promise. He it would be lightning. Can we not have a lesson? Can the lesson be me smacking you in the face? Yeah, the bouncing around thing is really weird. And I'm pretty sure that if those vats get hit with a potion, they blow up. Whoop, yep. I was right. Will you chill out with the potions, dude? One more hit. I'm just gonna go ahead and do that. Dude! Dude, can you please hold still? Thank you. So yeah, I got through that stage basically in eight minutes. Seven minutes, maybe. Because, you know, I died at the beginning. So this game is very apt for speedrunning. Okay, so there's a treasure chest in front of me, which means that there should be a nice little... Um... Catcher sequence. There we go. I'm going to go ahead and use the alchemy coin here. It goes for a while and actually bounces between enemies. No! Did I catch her? I think I caught her. I'm going to say I caught her. I don't think anything bad happens from not catching her. I was just trying to get more gold. I probably shouldn't have done that. Alright. The next part of the adventure has been revealed. Um, before I sign off today, I will do one more little mini fight.
And this stage is, once again, just a um, random um, wandering monster stage. Where lots of treasure can be gotten. Can I drop right there? Yes, I can. And there's a mole. If I play my cards right, maybe more treasure than I anticipated. Oh dear, oh dear, please don't die. I don't like how enemies respawn whenever they are too far off the screen. I'm gonna shoot that guy from over here. There's gotta be something else big, okay. Okay, and I think that's the end of the stage. Huh. Like I said, very short. All right, next time, I believe we're going to go to this nice question mark place, the Hall of Champions, and I'll tell you what that's all about. In the meantime, I'm Music Kev, and this has been Shovel Knight. See you then.